Out of the upgrades at Falcon Stadium, Air Force Athletics hosted a tour of the stadium's East Club renovations this afternoon. Our Brady King got a look at the progress so far and how the improvements will impact the fan experience. Falcon Stadium opened back in 1962 and it's finally getting a facelift. The addition of the new East Club is expected to make the stadium more modern and offer a fan friendly experience to watch Air Force football and lacrosse. Now the East Club will replace the existing East Concourse. The project adds more than 1000 premium seats. However, the capacity of the stadium will actually decrease by roughly 8000 seats, making tickets a little tougher to get. The new amenities include indoor seating, end zone to end zone viewing, more restrooms, more concessions, and enhanced entertainment opportunities. Plus, the new glass overhang will help keep the sound down on the field, improving the Falcons' home field advantage. But athletic director Nathan Pine says a big pro of this project is being able to use the space in addition to game day. The uh, utility of this space is going to be activated, you know, 300 plus days a year. And that's what you really want out of a football stadium. You know, it's nice to, to have a great experience for those six games, but for us to be able to do that throughout the year and bring folks to the academy is a really big piece of this project that you don't really understand until you can stand in the space. Well, these long overdue upgrades will help Falcon Stadium compete with the fan experience that Empower Field and Ball Arena offer. And there's no guarantees in construction, but Pine is proud of the progress they've made so far and says the project should be finished prior to Air Force football's home opener this August. For more information on premium seating, fans can visit falconathleticsfund.com. Reporting in studio, I'm Brady King, News 5 Sports.